Hello everybody. I've decided to make a little video to show you how to use Google Classroom on your phone. The first thing you need to do is to install the app on your phone using the link which Charon had posted on the WhatsApp group last night. Once you have installed Google Classroom, open the app. Then what the next thing you want to do is join the class. So you can either click that blue box that says join class or click the blue cross at the bottom right corner of the screen. Then you want to type in the code. The code for our class is 6PRKYCG. If you're done typing that in, click the blue box Join. Now, in order to view your assignments, click on the middle icon at the bottom of the screen which says Classwork. And then you can view all of your reading assignments as well as the discussion guides. Now, in order for you to answer the discussion guides, I'm going to show you how to access those documents. So let's, for example, click on this one, 15 June Discussion Guide. Swipe up. Sometimes you have to wait a minute for the document to, to load. There it is. You see the blue icon at the upper left-hand corner? Click on that. Now, this is just the preview. If you want to enter your answers, you have to open it in Google Docs. Click the three dots in the upper right-hand corner of the screen. Open with. It will probably ask you if you want to use Google Docs to open your document. All right, now, in order to edit this, in order to write in your answers, click the blue pencil at the bottom right of the screen. And now we see the question here. For example, to infuse means to combine one substance with another. With the result, the second substance is changed. Okay, how does this compare with Bible's teaching about justification in each of the following verses? Okay, so, for example, we look at... Where then is boasting? It is excluded because of what law? The law that requires works? No, because of the law that requires faith. For we maintain a main person is justified by faith apart from the works of the law. So there is, the answer is there is nothing we can contribute to our salvation. All right, go through the rest of the answers here. When you're finished, click the blue arrow. 